I've been wanting to come here all year. The whole entire year that I've lived in Tokyo, I've wanted to come here. So I'm so excited to finally be here. Right now I'm heading up to, it's one of like the most famous photo spots in Japan, I'm pretty sure. To the Chureitu Pagoda or something like that. Mount Fuji is fucking huge. <laughs> Just the fact that there's like nothing else around it. Oh, it's amazing. Wow. Perfect, perfect day. <laughs> crowded here not crowded but I mean there's there's quite a few people here obviously because it is absolutely stunning but to be honest considering how beautiful it is it's uh, not too busy not too busy at all holy crap it's so pretty it's massive oh, oh my gosh to come to this place for about five years now <laughs> the first time I saw the photo I didn't think it was real because I thought that the temple was from Kyoto and then obviously it's Mount Fuji but no it's a real place and it's just as magical as the pictures are there's a lot of places you can go to and then you'll discover that it's actually not as cool as the pictures show or it's not as magical or it's not as big or small or colorful whatever this place is so much more beautiful than any other photo I've ever seen in my life Wow, it's so magical. <laughs> I can't stop like just saying wow. It's actually like a dream, a dream come true to be here. This is amazing. It's taking me so long to get here finally. I did try to come here once but all the tickets were sold out for that day and also so there's a website where you can see a live view of what Mount Fuji looks like that day because if you come here on a cloudy day or if it's really hazy or something like that it's just not worth it. Sometimes it can be completely hidden like yesterday you couldn't really see anything and then I checked it that morning and there was just like a really kind of a, an average view of Fuji and I was like well if I'm gonna come here it better be good. So good timing today <laughs> this is definitely I think my new favorite place in Japan holy crap <laughs> uh -huh. Uh -huh. hey Sue 
Hey. What's the temperature? It's one degree outside. One degree. DSLR is not a good option. So. so the hotel that I'm staying at is like on the other side of the lake. So they said that there was a bus around here, but I can't seem to find it anywhere. So I'm kind of just walking and then if I see a cab on the way, I'll take the cab. <laughs> wow. She's so cute. Holy crap, I'm so impressed with the view. Ah! Wow. I mean, on the website, it said that it was the Fuji Sound view, but I don't know. I didn't really trust that it was actually going to be very good, but this is a really great view. Wow. flavor actually I do not know so the name of this hotel is called Komaya Yokan and I just booked it I actually booked it yesterday it was like super last minute choice to come here and it cost 155 Australian dollars so it's about 120 110 American dollars something like that it's a little bit on the expensive side I guess if you're trying to um, travel on a budget but it has a view of Mount Fuji, which is exactly what I wanted. It, I didn't mind too much if my room has Mount, a view of Mount Fuji, just so long as I don't have to walk very far to see a view of Mount Fuji, especially because tomorrow I want to wake up super early so I can watch the sunrise. So yeah, this is exactly what I wanted and it's just beautiful and simple and clean and minimal and I love it. I'm not sure if sunset is really gonna be like incredible. Um, I hear that sunrise is the best, the best time to view Mount Fuji, but uh, yeah. Either way, I'll be flying my drone and taking videos and, and all of that jazz. This is amazing. Wow. I can't stop taking photos of Mount Fuji. Holy crap. If you follow me on Instagram, you'll probably notice that I'll be spamming Mount Fuji photos for like, I don't know, the next couple months. <laughs> so beautiful. Wow.
think sunrise is definitely the better time to see Mount Fuji so yeah I'm really looking forward to that I don't know what time sunrise is but it's not too early I'll probably just buy dinner from convenience store to be honest because then I can eat it in my room while I'm editing and then my hotel that I'm staying at they've got an onsen as well so more than anything I'm so happy that my hotel has like the most beautiful prime view of Mount Fuji that I really wanted to see. That's why I picked it. I made sure that it was a place that was across from the across from the lake, but I'm just really glad that it's delivered on those expectations. But yeah, off to the convenience store. Huzzah! And then yeah, I'll see you tomorrow.